True North versus Magnetic North, does it matter? Depends where you are and what you're doing. The difference between True North and Magnetic North is called the declination. You can see on this map, we go from 30 degrees east declination to 30 degrees west declination. So in certain parts, Magnetic North can be off by 30 degrees from True North. If you need to just head in a general direction, then maybe you don't need to know your declination. However, if you're trying to find a specific point or area on a map, then you're gonna to wanna to know because over a period of three kilometers, if you're 15 degrees off, you're gonna be a half a kilometer off. I want you to remember, west is best, east is least. If Magnetic North is west of the True North, then add. If Magnetic North is east of True North, then subtract. It's not about east coast or west coast, but if Magnetic North is west or east from you. For example, if I was in Augusta, Maine, I would add 18 degrees to my bearing because Magnetic North is 18 degrees west from me. Now you know the difference between True North and Magnetic North and what a declination diagram is. Plan to survive, refuse to die.